Well, hello, audacious people. It's great to be able to share with you today. I've got a really good verse for you today. It's quite well known to many of you, but maybe if you're new to faith uh, recently, this will be a new one for you. And it's from the book of Isaiah in the Old Testament. Isaiah chapter 9, verse 6 and 7. And this is what it says. For a child is born to us, a son is given to us. The government will rest on his shoulders and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. His government and its peace will never end. He will rule with fairness and justice from the throne of his ancestor David for all eternity. The passionate commitment of the Lord of Heaven's armies will make this happen. Wow, what an incredible verse. Let's just look at some of the ways it describes Jesus. So first of all, he's a wonderful counsellor. A counsellor is someone who helps you. Usually when you get into difficulty, it doesn't matter what situation you are in at the moment. Jesus is a wonderful counsellor who is here to help you. He's the mighty God. No one is greater than Jesus. And he's on our side. If God is for us, who can be against us? It says in Romans. He's the everlasting father. For me, a good father speaks of love and care consistently for his children. He's always there for us. And Jesus is always there for us. He never changes. Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today and forever. Just remember that. He's the Prince of Peace. You might be in a really bad situation today, a dire situation and the stress levels are going through the roof. But Jesus, it can bring you peace. Set your eyes on him and he will give you the peace that is beyond your understanding. His government won't end. Uh, it's quite interesting. Recently in the UK, we've had changes of government almost on a weekly basis. It's been a crazy time, but his government won't end. Right from the beginning of time to the end of time, God is in control. It doesn't matter what's happening in the world. God is in control. And we need to remember that when we come into different situations. God is in control of situations and he's passionately committed to making his promises happen passionately he when he says something he's going to do it these verses were written something like 700 years before jesus was born isaiah never saw them fulfilled his children children's children and and so on and so on didn't see them fulfilled but god was going to commit was going to fulfill his promises no matter what and it was just the right time so keep trusting keep declaring keep your eyes on jesus today see who you can bless today be generous with your time and your money and walk with the holy spirit in fellowship with the holy spirit and you will have a great day thank you